Sluter Deco SG is a profile that can be used as a support channel for glass panels. It may also be used as a decorative profile to create an attractive shadow gap between tiles or other wall coverings. Deco SG is available in anodized aluminum and stainless steel. The channel of the profile is offered in two widths, 1 half inch and 9 sixteenths inch. This enables the use of glass panels up to 3 eighths of an inch and 1 half inch thick, respectively. In this video, we will be using Deco SG on the wall and floor to support a glass panel in a curbless shower application. Our shower has already been prepared to receive tile, including the installation of the Schluter shower system and Schluter Dietra uncoupling membrane. Work on the tile installation has already begun. The Schluter Dialex EKE corner movement joint was installed up to the planned location of the Deco SG. We selected the profile height according to the thickness and format of the tile and width according to the thickness of the glass panel. Deco SG is installed at the same time as the tiles. First, we'll measure where the Deco SG profile will be installed on the wall. Transfer the measurement to the profile. Remember to always observe all safety instructions and standards. Since we are using the anodized aluminum version of the Deco SG, we will be using a miter saw with a non-ferrous blade to cut the profile. For best results, cut the profile slowly. An accurate cut helps ensure a clean installation. Then, file the cut end of the profile to remove any burrs. Keep in mind, different tools will be required depending on what profile material you are using. Aluminum and stainless steel can be cut using a variable speed angle grinder set to the lowest speed with the Schluter ProCut TSM cutting wheel. A third option for aluminum is to simply use a hacksaw with a bimetal blade. Dry fit the profile before moving forward. We must avoid any overlap of the anchoring legs where the profiles meet at the floor to wall transition because this will interfere with the tile installation. Metal snips can be used to cut away the anchoring leg to avoid any overlap. We used a level to ensure our profile is plumb and placed a mark on the wall where it will be installed. Using a notched trowel, apply thin set mortar to the area where the Deco SG will be installed. Firmly press the anchoring leg of the profile into the thin set mortar. Next, we trowel additional thin set mortar over the anchoring leg. This is necessary for full coverage and support of the tile edges. Solidly embed the tiles into the thin set mortar so that the tiled surface is flush with the top of the profile. Leave a space of approximately 1 16th to 1 8th inch for grout. Don't forget to remove excess setting material from the profile immediately to avoid any damage to the finish. The Deco SG is installed along the shower base in the same way. Take care to align the profiles, paying close attention to the area where they meet. Once the tiles have been set and grouted, the glass panel is inserted into the channel of the Deco SG, as per the glass panel manufacturer requirements. As you can see, not only will Deco SG support glass panels, it also provides discrete and elegant lines within the tile assembly.